Hello, everybody. My name is Michael. And I hope you see and hear me well. And it's glad to be here in front of you again to present to you the amazing technology we have all well come to hear and listen and to learn more about. So I will uh, introduce myself shortly. And then I will then I will continue with the topic of of, uh, of the technology, as you can see behind me as well on the poster there. It is it is a second level string, sorry, second level pre-stress string technology. So basically, it's elevated. It's up in the air, up high, and it has so many benefits and so many well great aspects about it that. I just have to share them with you for you to gather or, well, maybe understand it a little bit thoroughly and um, and make your own, of course, decision about the technology. But it is for you to get the glimpse and the insights of what's uh, happening at the moment and what are the prospects if we think about the future. Because as you might know, we all can be investors as well. So it's possible at the moment, these are the last stages or the last stage, basically the 15th stage, which, uh, which is well here now. And then we have three sub stages within 15 stages. Well, basically there are 15 development stages of Skyward technology. When we were at the first stage, we basically had nothing. We had only the visions, the pictures, the calculations, everything on the paper. Of course, well, we we had land as well. Uh, well, the Skyward technology had land as well. And therefore, we started cons the, con the construction of the first supports, the first lines, the first models. We bought uh, the first equipment and so on so basically 15 stages means whenever we will reach until the end of the 15 stage we will have the well at least well not at least but we have the full complex of different models which are certified which are tested demonstrated and uh, ready to be exposed uh, as commercial technology, which will be in use for people to use for cargo to move, and so on. And until the end of the 15 stage, we all have the possibility to take part of it to basically um, give financial support to the project to the owner to the company, to the main company and receive for that uh, and receive for that um, payments or the installments, we receive shares. And basically, wherever in the world Skyward Technology will be built, we will take part of it. And the profits are divided. 20% of, uh, of, of the profits are divided between all the investors. So that's why it's extremely important at the moment to basically uh, to take part of it because these are the this is the last step the 15th stage we have we still have the moment and after that we well the company does not ac acquire any more well extra resources um, and the next stage will be when we go through the ipo process and on to the open market and there we can of course trade our shares if we have them already or then buy from from the market as well but it can take a lot of time, as we know, by, by the well, examples of Twitter, for example, or, or, or Facebook. It took about 15, 20 years uh, for those companies, not Twitter, sorry, I meant um, Alibaba. Those, those companies took about 15, 20 years until they reached or went through the process of IPO, initial public offering, and, and entered uh, uh, NASDAQ. 
basically. That's, that's the future, but uh, it can take another 10 years or another 15 years more. But the dividends, those are absolutely different area. But more about that, hmm, that, that, that uh, topic is for another presentation, uh, which, which is well focused on the monetary aspects. But, but today we are focusing more on, on the technology itself. But if you are interested in uh, learning more about the information, you can go to the, go to your public uh, back, back office. And there you can, uh, uh, you can see all the documents. You can download it, PDFs. You can see the installment programs, which is possible to, well, what is possible to do to get these valuable uh, shares of the company and much more information. All the news sector, sector as well, dating back to, well, five years, I, I believe, or four years. So basically you can take uh, out what, what was happening uh, back back in 2018 or, or 17 and, and up, up until today. So they are constantly renewing this news because the process constantly goes on. And today we have two perfectly, well, perfectly set up um, demonstration and certification centers. The first one, the first one that was ever built uh, is located in Belarus, in Marina Korka. And uh, well, I have been there myself as well. I have had the chance to, to try with a, try with a um, Unibus, try with Unicar as well, up high about 12, 15 meters. I see guest has uh, asked, is it possible to take a ride with Skyway? Yes, it is, but uh, only in those demonstration certification centers at the moment, because in, in Belarus, where I had the chance to ride with it, there is about approximately one kilometer road and one kilometer line, so to say. It's basically the same line, which is up there, uh, <laughs> up, 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 on, up on my head. And it was amazing, really. It was so smooth and all the view on, on the surroundings. It, it's just fabulous what, what is waiting for humankind in, in the following years. But yes, and the second demonstration certification center is located in the United Arab Emirates. And well, in Belarus, we have more uh, around seven, uh, I think it was seven or eight different track structures already constructed. We have seven different models already certified in uh, now in back in now let's go back to let's go let's move on to united arab emirates where we have our second uh, uh, demonstration certification center which is called um, innovation center it's located in emirate called sarja which is about um, half an hour drive from dubai and there i was quite recently actually in this year's january and I have some photos for you to present as well and to look. And I hope you enjoy them. But let me describe a little bit more about uh, about this, these uh, photos here. So basically, this uh, on the right side, there is this territory, which is, well, mm, pierced with this fence or yeah, divided with this uh, fence from, from the other surrounding, so to say. On the right side there, there, that's a glimpse of the main building, the Innovation Center. That's not only for Skyway, but there are many other innovation innovation projects going on uh, with uh, together with United, uh, uh, sorry, United, uh, well, the Sarcha and uh, American University, basically. United States, I meant to say, yes, uh, but uh, the university area is on the left side on this picture and there well I drove through the university area then it's this roundabout which you can see here and where those cars are driving at the moment you see this that black car and gray car we also went that way and I well of course did many photos and videos during this uh, this road but there we have three track structures Two of them, well, one of them is completely finished, ready. That one is the first one and the 400 meter track. I'm not going to show you that, that track at the moment, but I'm going to show you the second track, which uh, 
quo was almost ready in January, but now it's finished. And that one is 2.4 kilometers long. So that's 2,400 meters. It's very, very long route. And uh, well, basically you cannot, this, this is made, basically this, uh, I'll show you the next picture. Yeah, you can see on the left side, there, there are the supports where this, uh, well, the two left, the palm trees, which are on the left side, the two, one, two palm trees. Uh, between them, you can see already the support. You can notice that. And on the right side, that's the innovation center itself, as I mentioned to you before, but let's move on. Yes, here you can see. So uh, those are two terminals. One is the container terminal, which has only supports installed at the moment. As you can see there, there is no line, but on the left side, that one is cargo and passenger uh, terminal. And that one is now finished 2.4 kilometers. Absolutely amazing. As you can see here, the, the rails are elevated already and there will, and the difference is basically the distance between supports, the cargo and passenger terminal has, uh, the longer distance because it's, uh, it has to hold lighter weights, but the container terminal, which is meant for sea containers that has to weigh, uh, which weigh more than 15 tons, 50 tons. That one has to have more supports placed. Mm. And, and therefore those tracks are different. They, they, they have different uh, initiative and, and uh, meaning goal. And here you can see. This is a nice picture to show you, but I have already drove about uh, one and a half, one and a half, uh, well, 1500 meters is behind me of the, of the same road structure. And, um, and there in the end, you, you can glimpse at, at, at the end station basically, but yes, but, but the dif difference between the placement of supports and the distance between the supports is very well visible here on this slide. But eventually, well, if you think about that, we can elevate this technology 100 meters above the ground, uh, about, uh, yes. And as you can see here, uh, again, up high on my head, that one is elevated. Well, those uh, supports, they are basically um, these buildings which have all these infrastructures inside, all the shops and working territories and so on. And the travel goes on only between, uh, only with uh, Skyway technology between these towers and the mainland mainland and those supports here behind me here those are placed on the sea but since they are so high about 100 meters and so then these supports can be the the distance between two supports can be even even longer than one kilometer 1000 meters so that's just amazing Yes, that's the, the future. All right, and now let's move on. Some, some news more. Successful certification of intermediate support for the fourth test track was done and the certification is necessary and the verification process as well. Those are necessary because they give feedback to the company, feedback to the investors, the security to the investors, as well as the potential clients and all the technologies that we use today need to have these processes uh, well they have to be tested as skyway skyway has to drive hundreds of thousands of kilometers um, before they can uh, reach to have these certificates so that's why it's very important and since we didn't see the container transportation uh, well a track structure here it is in front of you and just a few words about it one is that uh, one great thing about this uh, this track structure and this container uh, technology and that is also why it's called revolution technology is that the speed is much faster than we have with today's varieties for example the sea transportation Mm, train by train uh, and of course the trucks those all have about well the, mm, the average speed is about 20 to 40 kilometers per hour which basically means well 
it's about uh, four times slower than with Skyway, what we can reach with Skyway. And with Skyway, we have another aspect. We can use both sides of the track structure. We can be in the hanging mode, so to say, below the tracks, uh, track. And we can be on top of the track, as you can see here on the slide. That's that's another great, great thing about Skyway. And the loading time, unloading time is less than one minute. So that fastens things well rapidly we can say but all right mm. quite recently the ruler of emirate of uh, ras al uh, kaimah visited the unitsky u sky is basically it comes from the name unitsky because the creator of this technology who is on the slide as well in this bluish dress um, uh, there uh, suit, sorry, not dress, but suit, uh, bluish suit uh, on the left side. That man is called Dr. Anatoly Unitsky. And Dr. Anatoly Unitsky is the creator and the owner of this um, company with all of us, of course, as investors. We're all owners. And this idea of, of elevated pre stress string transportation technology has been in his head for more than 40 years already. And that's also an amazing thing to well to understand that uh, this is not a new newly created idea or something it has been there because he is an en an, an engineer uh, he has enormous diplomas enormous amount of different diplomas achievements you can all see that in your back office mm, it's visible there and 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 uh, you, you can google him or 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 uh, download this book called 100 Questions and 100 Answers uh, of Skyway. It's, it's possible to find in PDF uh, format for free. But um, the main thing is that the idea of, of this transportation technology has been there for, for decades. But 2015 is the year when we started, when he started and the company started with the help of the investors uh, to implement and install this support to try to test these um, different aspects of these technologies, these uh, strings and, and and the models and and today within this well, if, if you think about 2015, we had only that land plot basically, basically, and now we have two demonstration and certification centers, one in Belarus and the other one in United Arab Emirates, and th those both are amazing. As I mentioned to you before, I have been in Belarus. In in uh, Ekotechno Park, in Marina Korka, but also have been uh, three times in United Arab Emirates, and that's just amazing. And, and yes, but uh, what is the meaning of this slide? Again, back to the slide. Mm -hmm. Sorry, I got carried away a little bit. But uh, the meaning of the slide is that very very important people all around the world come constantly to the demonstration centers, both in, in these two locations, visit us, mm, well, secret agreements ha have been done. We have um, signed multiple contracts already for commercial projects as well, but those will be uh, viable and visible, well, and well, shown to us when everything is in that phase, because many of those contracts are, uh, well, it's, it's not possible to show show to public uh, public eyes size for for many different reasons but um, everything goes according to plan yes and now the transition to the project of 15 stage of development as i mentioned you before as well that uh, we have reached reach this uh, this stage now we have what we have talked about for 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 many many years that it's going to happen and when this 15 stage will end we will we as current investors and well new people as well we won't have this opportunity anymore to invest in the main company basically to receive the main uh, company's shares which will take part wherever in the world skyway technology well, will be built at the moment we will get the share from each of those projects we will benefit from the from the whole bot 
but later there will be of course some projects maybe some certain address projects where we can invest or the hummus project um there we have this uh, self-flying helicopter basically that project is basically possible to 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 invest hopefully we don't know yet the, those details but uh, the the board has has talked about those uh, ideas at least but at the moment it's very important to understand that we have this uh, we have reached this 15 stage of development we have three sub stages here sub stage one two and three and and uh, we still have this opportunity to benefit from from uh, from the, from the main project so to say for more information go to your back office check it out uh, get the, get more information get yourself verified if you have not yet verified in your back office of that there are some details and documents and so on and then you can transfer and then make investments if you want and of course all these all these packages of information that's possible to find from from the back office starting from all different documents audits um, then the news and then well the, there is plenty of material for you to go through to get more um, secure of this project and to understand more or more of it all right now let's move on to the part two uh yes guests uh yeah i already answered that question all right let's uh let's let's go let's let's move on but uh, now let's see the answers why scow is the technology as Dr. Anatoly Nisko uh, has said well, quite recently in his uh, New Year video as well, he said that we are ahead of our possible competitors for more than 10 years at the moment. And, and, uh, and I show you now the reasons why. I see Mirozic has asked, when is EcoFest? Ecofest, uh, uh, well, since I'm from Estonia, from Europe, we had this board meeting here quite recently, a few, few months ago, and then the board said that uh, it is really, 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 really possible that Ecofest takes place this year, but not in Belarus, but in, in United Arab Emirates, in Sarja. But at the moment, I don't have the exact dates to give you. But whenever those dates will be revealed and uh, conditions and so on, then I will share you those immediately. And I urge you all to come there, take that time, invest that money for the travel, because of course, Dubai and then the United Arab Emirates, Emirates are very beautiful as well. Then come there meet uh, meet the Skyworld community family and then uh, hopefully with Dr. Anatoly Niski as well and of course you can come and see these uh, tracks there maybe even take a ride as in as in Ecofest uh, back in Belarus we had that chance so I will reveal those dates but mostly stay tuned go to your back office look at the news well each uh, week for example or, or after a few days and then yes stay tuned mainly <laughs> all right but the first of course is that it's innovative never before has any anybody done that uh, in our history this pre-stressed string technology and it looks fabulous it looks very beautiful it's possible to design these supports in different uh, ways um, according for example, with city councillors or, or city designers in, in different regions of the world. And then what more makes it innovative is that we have our own motor wheels uh, and derailment systems. So basically we have this all works fully on, uh, well, the, the, the energy source is electricity. It, it works fully on, on electricity. There are its own batteries, the motor wheels, and and uh, if we even turn this technology upside down, it, it won't fall off from the track structure. These are all great, great things. Yes, you can see another picture of it. It's just really, really beautiful. 
And now a little bit about the track structure itself, what is inside of it. So as I mentioned, there are pre-stressed strings, these punches of those. They work as a bridge, basically. If if they take uh, if we take an image of, of of normal bridge in our minds, then with bridges, it's kind of similar. Uh, and here they are; those are bunches of razor strings which are inside the metal frame, and it's filled with special filler to make it smoother, uh, to reduce the noise pollution as well. And um, and we can even take these tubes through the track structure for, for example, electricity cables or Ethernet cables and so on. So it's basically possible to take com different communications through the track structure for surroundings in African countries, for example, where there are, well, mm, territories which do not have constant electricity and then so on, so or, or internet. So it has like these extras, a lot of extras. Well, here it is, EcoFest back in 2019, uh, where I was presented myself as well. And I got the chance to drive with that unicar up high there, about 12 meters above the ground. And as I mentioned before, it, it's just brilliant. And here you can see there on the right side that there is uh, one bridge as well, which is made by Skyway Technology, these pre stressed strings, and then uh, just to demonstrate and then make this more visible. This, uh, well, relation between those two, two different, well, things, so to say. But it's amazing. So if that possibility arrives again uh, for all of us to go to the EcoFest in United Arab Emirates, uh, United Arab Emirates, definitely I recommend for all of us to go there. Now, the second point is that Skyway is ecological and it has many reasons why. First of all, it's fully uh, running on electricity. So there are no CO2 levels that will be a, a that will be put out in the air through the well movement. Then, um, yes, since uh, well, I hope this picture describes everything I, I was meant to say. But I, I will just say a few few words about this uh, slide as well. Since today we have this situation where more and more people go to live in the cities, especially in the bigger cities, where, where is work, better pay, mm, bigger wages, so to say, and um, that causes enormous amount of new challenges. Since, well, especially in the city centers, we just cannot tear down the ancient or the old houses or buildings to widen the roads, for example. In bigger cities, we have all, already built the underground systems as well, the subways. But since the population grows, we we face new challenges constantly. And uh, well, every person today who has driver's license mostly can afford uh, a car. And that, that is another aspect of this uh, or the meaning of this slide that the pollution of of uh, of the first level infrastructure is enormous that's why we need another solution we need to solve these new arising challenges and that's that's why the only way what i see or or at least the main main uh, thing about solving that is to go to the second level because otherwise we will face these situations like in japan where uh, the government has hired or the dreamy companies has have hired these um, workers with the hats you can see there that those are called pushers and the, the meaning for them is to push the last people on board so basically to, to fit 100 100 10 percent the train which uh, then takes off and then it, it constantly goes on like that but with skyway since we have this possibility to set another model 
to leave the station in 30 seconds in one minute we won't face this these kind of problems because the flow is much greater we can serve much more people in the same amount of time and when we think about the energy itself and the consumption of energy let it be the fuel or oil or electricity because cow is fully on, on electricity nevertheless we need to think about all the ideas to reduce the level of different uh, well uh, different different things from outer side such as wind to, uh, resistance and wind resistance has taken taken minimum to minimum uh, by the designers by dr antonio nitsk mainly because in that way we will use less energy and uh, how it's done of course the shape of the body of each our models have designed to cut the wind perfectly and the second very important aspect is that we won't have this screen effect screen effect means if we think about the car below on the slide then below the car there is asphalt or the road structure and between car and the road structure there is no place for the wind to go for the air to go and that causes the wind um, uh, the screen effect yes i hope you you understood that that side but uh, another aspect is the road um, maintenance and the enormous amount of resources that go to maintain maintain the roads for example in african countries or in dubai or in united Arab emirates the sandstorms after the sandstorms there are well uh, equipages which go to clean the road and then for example in the winter time there are these special heavy trains which clear the path for the commercial ones otherwise the commercial ones could uh, go off the rails and the accident could happen and so on but with skyway we won't face those kind of problems because we are elevated and, for, and what is more important, we do not have these. It's much more secure, secure than than, for example, cars, because we are not facing the opportunity to go to collide with the first level infrastructure vehicles or objects. It's not possible to crash into cars or trucks or trains because we are above them. We have our own track structure, our own uh, infrastructure, so to say. And that's why it's more than 90% uh, secure than, than today if we think about going to take a bike ride, for example. And it's just fabulous to see that up high from there. But all right, guys, today we have come to an end of our webinar, today's webinar. I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, next time in a week, uh, next week on uh, Thursday, uh, we will talk about uh, another five points of why Skyway is here to stay and why it's very important to, well, for Skyway to go and rock the world because and why it can change the world, why it is already changed and uh, it's going to change it much more uh, in the future when we have fully developed all these different uh, different models certified them and we, when we are going to start uh, building and constructing these commercial tracks all around the world so the next webinar go is taking place um, in a week next week on thursday 20th of april uh, 8 pm gmt plus time time zone and the topic is basically the same. We will see if there are any new excellent news, which I have to just uh, cover for you to get a glimpse of, of the recent happenings, live happenings, so to say. And of course, then we will cover another five points because there are seven reasons why Skyway is, uh, well, why Skyway? Which answered to the, to, to the question why Skyway? And we covered today the two of those and five of uh, five questions are more there to discover so i hope i see you all uh, 
in a week. If there are any questions, it's time to ask them now. I already saw a few questions, those we have answered and covered. But if there are no questions, then see you already in, uh, in six days. <laughs> All right. Thank you again for coming and goodbye.